If we drive forward... Oh! Um, okay. Okay. Want to keep up with the latest Garrett Plays videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. Yo, yo, people, get in here for another video. So, guys, we're back in Farm Zone 19, and we're going to be doing some logging. That is right, doing some logging. You guys seem to be enjoying the logging series, so we're going to gonna do some more. Uh, but, yeah, guys, so, last video, if you guys didn't see it, we got... Uh, we got our equipment over to like a logging area and like just like the JCB and stuff with the two attachments cut down two trees a small one and one that's a little bit bigger got a really really nice looking load here and then uh, yeah and we just took our Chevy over here but that's really what we got accomplished last video this video I want to buy new equipment uh, to kind of upgrade our production a bit and then on top of that uh, I think we'll just probably we'll, hopefully we'll sell some logs. I don't know if we'll get to that though in this video um, And I don't know how much more weight this can carry. That's the other thing So we're gonna have to see I we should be at least able to get one more tree on here But I'm I don't know. I'm hoping to get a little bit more than that Hopefully at least two more but it is already starting to get stacked a bit high and we're just using straps right now, right? So either way, let's go ahead uh, click P and then we can see what we have for our options so I'm thinking and if we go into forestry equipment uh, last video at the end we saw that there is a few different things one being this buffalo now the buffalo would be nice because it has the arm and has the trailer right so what this would allow us to do is it would allow us to uh, pick up bigger logs we can cut logs by hand I have no issue doing that we have the JCB which makes it even faster right and then, but on top of that, transporting them, uh, we really need a better trailer for that. And this thing obviously could pull the weight. So this is one option, and that would be 221,000. And then we have this man, which would be another option. Uh, it looks like it could hold maybe longer logs. It goes faster um, as well. The arm folds up, which I don't know how much I like that. That's the only thing, right? And I'm worried about like how stable that is. And then we also have whatever this thing is, which I don't know. It looks to have a long arm, but that's about it. So let's go. I, th I think we'll go with this one. I think we'll go with the Buffalo. Um, and yeah, and then for the tires, uh, what are the, are, why are the tracks that color? That's very weird. Um, yeah, let's not get tracks then. Okay, let's go ahead we will buy this make sure to not lease it we'll buy it there we go we're just over a million dollars now and then i don't know if it's going to fit on our trailer let's just tab over and let's see if we i don't know we have our nissan here right would it fit on this trailer it might be too wide that's my biggest concern uh we can see though we can see because we can go faster if we take this right so that's why I would like to use this trailer to bring it over. Uh, okay, so to get back, we go this way. Yes. I think we actually, it might be faster to go up top, but I think this is the way we usually go. So we're just going to keep going like that. Yeah, I think like this kind of like lowers down and raises back up. So it's kind of weird. Oh, wow, someone's walking up there. I didn't know that is something that people can do. That's very cool, actually. Uh, well, that is like the detail that I really like on this map. Uh, by the way, guys, the map will be down below. But yeah, it's like it's like a gold crest kind of. It kind of puts gold crest to like. It kind of makes gold crest look like a joke. That's the best way to put it. Uh, it's a very very big map. It has all the aspects of like gold crest that we knew and loved. Uh, but then in the new game, FS19, and then just has so much more. Looks so much better and. Yeah, it's 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 nice. Um, okay, we'll go this way. I see a fire station, by the way. I wonder if the doors on it work. I doubt it. But there is a fire station over there. Interesting. I think that's the fire station that used to be on the KST map. By the way, I wonder, like, are we going to get a KST map in, in this game? Like, the KST map was, as you guys know, like, our favorite map. But, okay, I'm going to be honest. In FS19, this definitely is one of the top maps if it's when it comes to like doing logging and stuff I would say this map when it comes to like 
just doing like fun like um like checking out like some cool mods and like racing and stuff obviously lambo's map takes the cake for that uh by far right like i wouldn't want to be doing racing on this map uh but when it comes to like even like farming aspect i think this map would be the actually for farming this would be a little bit difficult because it's so big right you would really have to be driving far uh but yeah okay Th wow this thing is big it's heavy i don't know if realistically we would be able to pull this thing um i wish it had a trailer hitch that's one thing but yeah okay let's see it does articulate that's one thing i don't really like about that but okay so far not looking good for when it comes to weight if we drive forward oh um okay okay back that up what um maybe if we keep it at the back it will be okay yeah let's see let's fold up the trailer if we can uh the trailer won't fold up i'm clicking the wrong button no i'm on the wrong vehicle there we go will that fold uh okay okay i know that's bad for a vehicle okay there we go let's put this back a bit i i think if we stay on the back wheels it would actually be able to pull it again don't know how realistic if we drive forward it's an issue but like yeah our wheels are all gripping good the front ones might spin a little bit here but looks pretty good so yeah, let's see if we can bring this over. Uh, I'll put down the straps, but again, I doubt this in-game vehicle will strap down. And, okay, how do our lights look? We'll just put on those lights. I like the top ones, but it's daytime. We don't really need those ones on. Okay, here we go. Yeah, let's see how this does. I'd like to drive it all the ways over if we can. Now, something to note, though, is that... Okay, got to be very careful. Uh, we'll turn our hazards actually too. There we go. Got the hazards on, and I'll click the beacon button. But I don't think there's any beacons on here at all. Yeah, definitely no beacons. Uh, the hazards are on. It's very hard to tell, but they're definitely on. Either way, let's keep going here. Uh, but yeah. So something to note is I have no clue how to get over to the area that we're going to. Uh, we took all these random turns last time, so it's gonna be a challenge. And all, we have equipment over there, so we're going to have to figure out a way. We definitely have to figure out a way over to the same spot we were in previously. So, we, like, we'll be able to do it. It just it might take a minute or two. Okay. Here we go. Let's stay on the road the best we can. It is driving okay, but it's just throwing me off, like, having this giant thing back there. I'm just trying to make sure we stay on the road properly. Okay, so I know we usually go down like we usually turn to go down here uh i think this time we'll stay up top yeah yeah you see like this turn out here that's usually what we take i believe right actually no that's not did we already go wait what how am i already lost this is the area we know okay let's go ahead oh wait i see our equipment okay okay it was a good choice going up here it's literally just straight ahead Last time we took all these, like, turns went all the ways around, right? But it's literally just up here. So that's all good. Um, okay, so let's keep going. Yeah, look at that. That's awesome. Okay. That is actually really, really cool. I wonder how much our logs will sell for, by the way. Like, should be a decent amount. Okay, let's go ahead, though. Um, okay, now we have a few options here on what we want to do. In order to unfold this, we need to drive it forward a bit. Hmm. We or or it does have giant ties. We probably can just drive it off. So I think that's what we'll do. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just drive it off. Okay. Let's see how you do. Our our car is gonna be lifting up a bit here. <laughs> there we go. Our car is actually staying down pretty good. Yeah, it definitely would be too heavy for the Nissan in her life. So my bad for you guys who like stuff all realistic. I probably should be a bit more realistic on the series, but you guys know we we often aren't realistic at all. So yeah, it's it's weird like doing like this video topic is something realistic, right? Um so yeah.
I don't know. Like, when we're doing races and stuff, right? Like, I don't know. When we're doing, like, the crazy... We have, like, crazy equipment on a crazy map with crazy racetracks and all this crazy stuff happening, right? Um, it's not that realistic. But for logging, like, we could make this quite realistic if we wanted to. And I, I do want to make it a bit more realistic. So my apologies about putting that thing on the trailer. I just, I don't know. I, I thought the drive would be longer too. Either way, let's start chopping stuff down. But before we do that, here's a message from our sponsor. Join Lambomod's Patreon page to instantly receive access to some amazing modern creations. You will get early access to Lambo, Winston, and Beardshot's awesome ideas. On top of all that, you will get cool textures and other unique modding tools. Join today using the link below. Okay, so there we go, guys. So let's get in the JCB. And then, yeah, let's drive back a bit. There we go. Whoops. Okay. Um, It's driving weird. I think, yeah, we just had our, our implement, our tool, too low. But let's start cutting this stuff down. So I think we'll probably, the angle we want to cut at, I'm thinking we'll just cut it this direction. That should be good. So let's go ahead and start it up. We'll lower this down a bit, flatten it out. Okay, and then, uh, there we go. Perfect. Wow, that is so quick. Okay, then we'll also just do, well, uh, okay, no. We'll just stick with this one for now. There we go. Okay, so let's shave this tree all the way down. There we go. Let's keep that cutting, shaving it down. Come on. Come on. There we go. Um... Yeah, that looks looks like it's all good. Okay, and then, so, I don't think we can fit the whole thing, but we should just be able, I don't know, cut this in, like, well, you know what, we can just cut off the end, right? So, we could go, like, this, maybe? Here, let's see how that does. Because then, this piece, we can move by hand and just put it in our other trailer, right? Uh, it might be actually a bit big. Uh, no, that works. Yeah, it's a little bit big, but it's okay. Uh, yeah, let's just strap that down fully. I think that will be all good. Can you... There we go. Um, okay. Any more straps to adjust? I think we're all good. Let's just make sure that these ones are all good. Okay, that's nice. And then, yeah, so for this piece, we should just be able to use this. Our buffalo. So yeah, well, guys, just give me give me a chance to to learn this thing a bit uh, with the arm because I have really no experience with this. But let's see how it does. I I think I use these maybe like in the old game a bit, but we really haven't used them at all in this game. I don't know if we've ever used this vehicle in this game. Maybe once, maybe once, but even that I, I don't think so. Let's go ahead and bring this over. Um. Okay. So. We can bring it in a bit. Uh, I want to lower it down. Okay, so I'm kind of just guessing the controls, but we've used vehicles with similar controls, right? Okay, let's open this up. Uh, okay, we're going to have to raise this a bit. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay, bring the arm in. How do I do that? Uh, not really what I was trying to do, but there we go. That should work. Lower that down. Okay. I think we should be able to get a good grip like that. The log might be a little bit long. But here we go. Okay. How is that going to do? Um, let's see. Oh, yeah. Okay. It's, it is definitely a bit long. But I think it's okay. Uh, let's turn it around as well. Here, can we go like this? Uh, let's raise up a bit, because I do, hopefully we can fully turn this around. Do we have enough space? Yes, we do. Perfect. Okay. And then we will bring over this log like so. Uh, turn it. Lower it down. How do I lower? Uh, the lowering down part is what I have to work on. There we go. Okay. Perfect. Um, okay. It's definitely a little bit big. Not going to lie. Uh, let's bring this in a bit. There we go. Okay. Now, can I just release? There we go. Okay. Perfect. 
Now, what I want to do, though, I am li it's way too long. We can cut it maybe, like, here. And then that should, like, kind of flatten out a bit. We're just going to do a little nudge. Uh, we can move this piece up by hand. There. Oh, jeez. Um, how did that happen? Okay. We're just going to go with it. And, yeah, we'll put that just kind of in here. Kind of resting there, maybe. That looks good. Okay. Perfect. And then this thing, we can move... Uh, we can like close in our grapple, lower this down a bit like so, and I think strap it. There we go. And I think that's good for this video. So we got new equipment. We brought it over here. And on top of that, we also um, we also got a tree cut and cleaned up and everything. Now, actually, what we should do is get rid of the stump before we end this. So that is what we will do. Here we go. Okay, so let's back on up. Watch our trailer. Um, okay. This thing does slide a bit. Oh, wow. We really left a lot of space there. Okay, perfect. Turn this thing on. And then where is that stump? Uh, there it is. Okay. We should just be able to... Should be actually quite quick to cut. Let's lower this down. And I think... Yeah, there we go. We're good. Okay. So let's go ahead and see. Yep, yep, that all cut correctly. Perfect. Okay, so we are we are all good with that. I like it. So let's just, I guess we'll just leave that attached. Um, but yeah, guys, so that's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. In next video, I think what we'll do is probably bring this load down and then cut more trees for this and maybe bring this load down as well. But at least we got we got to start selling some stuff, so... Yeah, this trailer is definitely getting full. We don't want to work the Chevy too hard, right? Uh, we don't want it to start breaking. And again, sorry for using the Nissan to bring over um, the Buffalo. It's probably not the best idea. But, like, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. we got to make sure to keep this series as realistic as we can. Just, just I don't know. Be, just take it easy on me, okay? Um, yeah, either way, there we go. Thanks for watching. You guys are awesome. Bye-bye. Want to play games with your friends? Grab a dedicated server from G-Portal. Make sure to click the link down below to receive an instant 5% discount.